Last night, I found these videos on YouTube I was watching of these, this one guy, sometimes two guys, <clears throat> literally in the jungle. They're in the jungle. I don't know exactly where, I think it's somewhere over in you know Southeast Asia, something like that. And they would literally just find a piece of land and they would start digging with their hands. They had, they had one tool that was like this kind of knife shovel thing. That was it. it, it to call it a shovel is an exaggeration. It was mostly just kind of a big knife. And they'd dig a hole and dig a hole and dig, 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 dig. And they would smooth it out and they'd turn this, this, this raw piece of land into like swimming holes and slides and... Um, huts and 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 bathhouses it was there were so many videos of it it was called a brave survival life is what i think the name of the channel was and and here's the reason i'm telling you because these guys imagine that imagine you go watch some of that it's like wow <clears throat> so the reason i'm bringing it up is because this this one guy or these two guys they would just find a raw piece of dirt and they would like use the land to like make clay and like cement type stuff it was wild and they were all doing it by hand right and it was so much work and I thought you know that's so interesting because anything you want to do it's just step by step by step by step by step by step by step you just go from where you are to where you want to go and lots of times the journey from where we are to where we want to go is much further than we're willing to walk i mean those guys i saw them and they just committed to doing it and they just worked 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 in sanity insanity right i mean i can't get myself to go to the gym and work out for an hour and it ain't as much work as what those guys are doing. And they're doing it for, I have no idea how many hours it takes them to make those things. But it's inspiring. And I just wanted to share that with you. Wherever you are, you, you are where you are. And where you want to go, you just got to walk the path. And it's usually a longer walk than you think it's going to be. But that's, that's, that's the problem, our expectations of what we think we can do, what we say we can do, of how far we say we can go. It's all made up. It's all made up. That's the difference, biggest difference between professional athletes and your average athlete. Uh, really successful business people and your average business people. Really successful parents and partners and average ones and below average ones. So I hope that I hope that helps. Right? Go watch Brave Survival Life. Jaw dropping stuff. Seriously. Um, and it's inspiring because it's just watching these guys just commit to something and do it. And it is a lot of work, you know. Think about digging a hole with a spoon. I mean, these guys don't have they don't have, they don't have an excavator or, or a backhoe or a tractor. But I swear to God, they, they did it faster with just their hands and their one knife, knife blade thing, than those two guys did it faster than uh, a crew of regular dudes with heavy equipment would do it. Seriously, it was, it was crazy. But it just goes to show what you can do if you decide you're gonna do it. Because those guys, when they were doing that, they weren't thinking, well, maybe we should quit or maybe it's time for a break. They just were like going, 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 going. And that's the way nature goes. When you watch a beaver build a dam, it's just going, 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 going. It doesn't put up a little bit of the dam and then lay around all day. It gets going. It's got a goal and it goes, 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 goes until it's done. You're awesome.